Hi, this is Mark from the Mongoose development team. In this video, we're going to talk about themes. Themes give us an opportunity to change the look and feel of our Mongoose-based app. Here we have a basic form for a construction company. We've imported a banner, and now we'd like to customize how buttons, combo boxes, and edits look. We could assign each of these attributes on the component, but if we create a theme and assign the attributes there, our customizations are going to apply to the entire app. If we wanted to override theme attributes on individual components, we could do that at any level of the inheritance model. For example, assigning attributes in a component class. Let's start by creating a new theme. In design mode under edit, select theme. Create a new theme named crown. We have a lot of form components that we can customize here. Let's start by changing the font on the button. Now change the button color to match our logo. We can change the background color, font color, its hover state, and its press state. We can even add a border and change the opacity and color of that too. Notice that I'm using these copy and paste buttons. You can copy your button attributes and paste them to make editing easier. And then let's also use a gradient when the button is pressed. Now let's customize the edit components. Again, I'll change the font for our edit boxes to match our buttons. It looked nice to have the required field be slightly red so that the users notice that they need to enter some info there. And then we can do the same thing on the TBD field. Okay, the last thing to customize in our theme is the combo box. Now we need to apply the crown theme we just made. In the View menu, under User Preferences, click on the Runtime Layout tab, and then select our theme. Enter Run Mode and let's take a look. Pretty nice. And here's what it looks like running as a form-only web page after I spend a few more minutes polishing the UI. Notice that when I hover over each of these components, the opacity increases. This is a nice little trick when you're using a background color or an image like I am here. For more tutorials and documentation, visit the Mongoose portal. For technical support, go to Infor Extreme. And if you have general questions or comments for us, email mongoose at infor.com. This is Mark Ellison with the Mongoose development team saying thanks for watching.